Okay, sports fans. Here, we're going to give a little demonstration of how we can run two 28BYJ48 stepper motors and their drivers from an ESP32 Dev Kit C and another ESP32 Dev Kit C communicating on the ESP Now protocol. So here we have a first ESP32, which has two buttons simulating joysticks here. So we have forward, right, reverse, right, forward, left, reverse, left. And that's just sending one and zeros into the ESP, which transmits by magic over the so-called ESP Now Wi-Fi network into this other one, which is receiving it and transforming, transforming those bits into code, which can drive the motors. The whole thing is run from nine volts using little five volt regulators to provide five volts independently to each of the ESPs. So these ESPs, as you can see, are separate circuits. They're not electrically connected. And now watch what happens when we send a little signal here. So here we go. Right motor forward, right motor reverse, left motor forward, Left motor reverse, both motors forward, both motors reverse, forward and reverse, forward and reverse. So it's very simple. And so now this is going to be used to pilot a tank like robot strand beast remotely. Very simple protocol to implement, very well documented very powerful ESP32s, which as you can see, consume about 14 or 15 milliamps. And when you run the motors, so let's see what happens when we run a motor, how many milliamps. So if we run one motor, oof, we get another, we get another 23 milliamps. And if we run two motors, we get uh, surprisingly another 46, 40, 40 milliamps. So that's 44 milliamps added. This one is, 38, this one is 38, there you go. So there you go, easily powered. And the reason I'm using nine volts here is to simulate a nine volt battery, which will be connected later and make the whole thing portable. Thank you very much, hope you enjoyed it.